So it's trying to, you know, show him what's possible to the PC brand so they might go, oh, I've been great. Yes. Um, so we're able to do that. and experience no pixel loss. And look at that. No pixel loss. Again. Look at just how fantastic that. What we have been able to achieve is the highest military standards from temperature shocks like high 60 degrees to minus 20, uh, acceleration, drop tests, as well as icing to make sure that the user is confident that the OLED foldable display that you buy is going to be perfect no matter what the user scenario is. One more time. Able to move a little bit and yet still have this type of performance. Bit of a challenging thing to do. What size of display are you? Tend The total size. So what we're trying to enable here is different form factors, fold in, fold out, a 360 fold, slide in or out, or a hybrid fold and a slidable. Uh, and that's, you know, you'll see, I mean, humans are really creative. So I think it's going to be a bright future for these old OLED foldable phones uh, in the hands of consumers. There is a passenger information display, there's a cluster information display. Uh, we have side or e-mirrors that are available. The last thing I would add that OLED offers is a very, a very customized uh, ability and flexibility to customize your display. So last year we had the OLED, which is a circular display, uh, which is not possible with an LCD. And then we'll go for it. Um, and this is the opposite. 